I am toast today. Like my body feels absolutely wrecked. Hands tore up, wrists feel weak. Today is a lot of hang cleans, a lot of box jumps. I've done like a workout vlog style video. A few of you guys requested it were the CrossFit videos. So in the CrossFit gym today, hitting a little workout, we're doing power cleans and box jumps. I am toast today. Like my body feels absolutely wrecked. So it's gonna be kind of brutal. We did box jumps on Saturday. And I was just super sore from them because I also did back squats. And then yesterday was a clean workout. Hands tore up, wrists feel weak. Today is a lot of hang cleans, a lot of box jumps. So I'm just warming up right now with 95 on the bar. My working weight for the workout is going to be 95, 135, and 155. So I'm going to get up to 155, see how that feels, and then we'll adjust from there in terms of the weight for the workout. But yeah, man, Breakfast Club CTG, we'll be in this beat. When it's hot, turn to the city, I broke out the notch. Got some more millies, I keep me a knot. I created history, it made me a lot. He tried to diss me and ain't no false. We call him Chopsy, cause they gonna chop. Took her out of fellas, cause the pussy pop. I run it like Nike, we got it on lock. Call it out. Alright, that's warm up set number one. If you're new here, my name's Rodrigo. I make functional fitness videos. I've been doing CrossFit for about 10 months now. Coming from the bodybuilding functional fitness area into CrossFit now. So if you're new here, don't forget to hit that like button, that subscribe button. Follow me on Instagram, shots underscore G. Let me know you came from here. And I hope you guys enjoy the video. I'm the boss man in the suit with no tie. I can't be sober, I gotta stay high. Put me some syrup in the can and it's dry. Riding this special like Bunny and Clyde. Don't worry, baby, I keep me some fire. She need names and burgers, she cannot decide. The ladies, Mercedes, will go to surprise. Don't sleep on this lady, her pussy up pride. This maze of weights, man. Hopping in here today, man. The energy is definitely gonna get me through this, for sure. You guys can tell her this guy. Don't get at my wrist, put my guess in the sky. She sing out my sauna and change her whole life. I told her to goggle and work on her highs. Everything litty, I love when it's hot. Turned to the city, I broke out the notch. Got some more millies, I keep me a knot. I created history, it made me a lot. He tried to diss me and ain't no fights. We call him Chopsy, cause they gonna chop. Took her out of fellas, cause her pussy pop. I run it like Nike, we got it on lock. Can Money. Key. Key. And a. Bang. 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 I wish I would have actually like filmed yesterday's workout, which I did. I'm gonna throw it up on the screen here. It was a ton of cleaning jerks and wall balls. It was brutal, man, because I suck at the jerks. So it was tough. I still managed to do it RX, which is the prescribed weights. But today, I don't know if that's gonna happen. Usually this weight's no problem, and I can cycle this fairly easy. That's that felt freaking hard, man. So we're gonna see how this goes. Put the billy cool back in the hot day and cut. I put the bitch in the front of the billy in front of the drive. And man, sit there and weedy can't smoke in the road. Right, wow, wow. I stepped up and cut up on drinking, I shoot off the ties. That seriously felt like it was 225. That felt freaking so heavy. My wrists feel fragile right now. I have a little fragile hands. I have tiny hands, by the way, if you guys don't know. I have tiny little hands, man, so gripping that bar is gnarly for me. But, still getting it done, 155. We'll see, because I think the last set's gonna be 693, or 963. So I might I might go one, I'm keeping the box, the box height the same for the prescribed weight. I'm gonna go 95, 135, 155. By those last few rounds, I'll, for the last few reps on 155, I'll just grind through it. I'll make it through. Just gotta finish, right? All right, so reps for the workout, I'm gonna put them up on the screen here. 
we're doing that. We're doing ankle power cleans followed by box jumps. And then those are all the reps. And then every, every time we finish that rep scheme, let's say 15, 12, nine, I'm gonna add weight and then do that until we're done. So my mentality is just to like focus on quality, make sure I get good reps and just finish, man. Cause I know I'm sore. I'm not going for like a record time. I'm not trying to beat myself up, especially cause like my elbows hurting and stuff. <laughs> just a lot of pulling lately, but that's the goal. Workouts up on the screen here. Let's go ahead and get into it. Every time I need the hymn to throw that to the side. Yeah. I get those goosebumps every time. Yeah, when you're not around, when you throw that to the side. Yeah. I get those goosebumps every time. I need the hymn to throw that to the side. Yeah. I get those goosebumps every time. Yeah, when you're not around, when you throw that to the side. Yeah. I get those goosebumps every time. time, time, time. Every time I need the hymn to throw that to the side. Yeah. I get those goosebumps every time. Yeah, when you're not around, when you throw that to the side. Yeah. I get those goosebumps every time. I need the hymn to throw that to the side. Yeah. I get those goosebumps every time. Yeah, when you're not around, when you throw that to the side. Yeah.
My arms are done. I feel like jelly. All right, that's, this is where I'm gonna wrap up this portion of the video. My camera is about to die. I thought I was gonna die mid-workout, so I'll see you guys at the house or whenever I get my battery charged up, but I hope you enjoyed that little lifting portion. Boom, welcome back, everyone. Got my camera charged up. We're good to go. That was a brutal workout, man. Not gonna lie, my hands were feeling it, man. They felt like jello. That was a tough workout. I'm not gonna lie, I even like thought about putting the weight. Oh, I guess I did drop the weight. I had to scale the weight. Obviously, I've just been fried. Saturday's workout involved back squats, heavy back squats, and then box jumps, and then dumbbell rows. I have just been fried from that. My legs have been so sore. It's like hard to flex my quads all the way in terms of just being able to extend them all the way, like that hurts, it's getting better though. I don't know why, but I haven't really thought to foam roll until yesterday, and that helped a ton. And then just like showers and stuff and sleep has helped a lot. Also nutrition's been pretty on point, so ever since getting back from my trip and then back in the CrossFit gym, I had to ease back into it. I'm just rambling now, but anyways, yeah. Back squats, box jumps, and then yesterday was a ton of cleaning jerks. Wall balls, so legs were toast, grip was fried, wrists were fried, shoulders, everything, and then today was just a ton of hand cleans. So I was just like sore and tight, and uh, but luckily the warm up today was good, it was nice and long. That definitely helped out, and I always love a good warm up. I'll either go run before CrossFit, since I'm doing no caffeine, I've been on no caffeine for about 10 months now, and running either like one mile to like three miles before working out is almost like a pre workout, and it helps me just get just the blood flowing and I feel way better. I perform way better in the workout sometimes. There's times wherever I, I kind of like drains me and I feel it, but for the most part, it definitely helps me out. It definitely helps me in terms of like the performance aspect of things. Um, but today was a good workout. It was tough, man. That's the beauty of CrossFit. It's a super hard workout. It's challenging. And then after you get to chat with people like, oh, how'd you do? And like, oh, it sucked. It was tough, but everyone got a good workout in today. The energy was high in there today. There's a lot of people as you guys saw in there. It was good, man. I love workouts like that because the energy's high and it's just, you just want to go in there and crush the workout. Out. But if you have any questions in terms of how you can do that workout or if you want to scale it drop it below or head over to Instagram Shoot me a DM there. I'm always happy to help and I'll even send you like a little video message um, If you guys have any questions regarding health and fitness So absolutely any questions drop them either in the comments or over on Instagram I was itching for another vlog style CrossFit video. I haven't done those in a while But let me know what you guys want to see more of I know a few of you guys wanted more CrossFit videos So thought I'd whip it out today camera out and take you guys with me through that workout Welcome back everyone. So I'm gonna go ahead and close the video out here. I know I didn't bring you guys along and show you guys those meals today. I totally forgot, but hey, I'm glad I at least got to show you guys another little CrossFit workout, take you guys along through that little workout and kind of my day. Led you guys on, I know I'm sorry, can't be doing that stuff. <laughs> but um, that's gonna do it for this video. Let me know what you guys wanna see in the comments. Do you guys wanna see like workout movement tutorials, tips, workouts like this, vlogs, recipes, motivational videos, or do you guys wanna to get to know me a little bit more? Leave it below in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Training and nutrition coaching, hit the link in the description. I'd be more than happy to help you guys out. If you have any supplement questions or need advice on what to get for your certain goals, shoot me a message or shoot it uh, in the comments below. I'll give you a list of my favorite supplements, stuff tailored to you. And if you wanna pick anything up, go to oneupnutrition.com, use code SHOTSG, you'll get an additional 20% off of whatever you're buying on top of all the sales that One Up Nutrition is running. As always, breakfast club CTG, we out the speed.